Hi, my name is Mark Smitten from SpreadsheetHowTo.com and this is my Excel 2007 guide on switching between worksheets. Now, before we begin, remember that a worksheet is where you actually enter the data and the formulas on the screen in Excel 2007. A workbook is the name for the overall Excel 2007 file. Think of the worksheets as pages within your workbook. Now, we can either use the sheet tabs at the bottom of the Excel 2007 screen to move between the worksheets or we can use a keyboard shortcut method. So first of all the worksheet tab method. Now as I say the worksheet tabs are located at the bottom of the Excel 2007 window. Clicking on each tab will make that page active and you can view it in the main window. You can use the worksheet tab scroll buttons to move through larger numbers of worksheet tabs. The buttons will take you back to the first worksheet tab, scroll one worksheet tab backwards, scroll one worksheet tab forwards, and take you to the last worksheet tab in your workbook file. You can also display a larger or smaller amount of worksheet tabs without the need to scroll. If you hover your mouse cursor over the edge of the worksheet tab box, until it changes into a small expand and contract icon. Hold your left mouse button down and move the mouse cursor to the left to make the worksheet tab area smaller or to the right to make the worksheet tab area larger. Now just quickly looking at the keyboard shortcut method. Now you can use control and page down to move left through your worksheet tabs and control and page up to move to the right through your worksheet tabs. If you need more free information on this and related topics check out my site at www.spreadsheethowto.com You can also download some of my more in-depth guides and spreadsheet templates at www.spreadsheetrepublic.com Goodbye for now.